Hi, I'm Jordy. And I'm Sam. And welcome back to our channel. And today we're going to be ranking AFL team season with a, a grade of a, like yes. A, B, C. Yeah. So without any further ado, let's get started. So we're going to start in alphabetical order from A all the way down to W. So Sam can go first. We're going to give Adelaide a C. I think it was a bit better than what they kind of thought they could do but yeah. next is brisbane and we gave brisbane a b because um they lost their finals and if they had won they might have gone on to win the fight next we gave carlton a c minus which is i think below par i'd say and um i think that was kind of what we expected of them okay so next is collingwood and we gave collingwood a d because they finished in the bottom four um so yeah um essendon i gave a b minus to even though they exceeded expectations um sitting in the eight isn't the just sitting sitting eight isn't the best but it's not the worst too for what they were projected to do the next is Fremantle, and we gave them a c because they missed out on finals again but hopefully um next year they can make the eight uh, next is geelong we gave geelong an a minus um they had a prelim final i think yeah they had a, they had a prelim they lost it but um i still think that's an a minus worthy Next is Gold Coast, and we gave them a D because I think we had a little bit more high expectations for Gold Coast this year. Hopefully, um, next year they can do better. Next team on the list is GWS. We gave them a, a B minus. They won their first final just, and they got, and then they lost their next one. So, mm -hmm. yeah. So the next team is Hawthorne, and we gave them a D because they also finished in. The bottom four. I think that we had a little bit more high expectations for Hawthorne this year, but they're on the start of a rebuild, which could be a very long rebuild at this present stage. We gave Melbourne the only A plus of the uh, teams because, again, they won the grand final, so no team was uh, equal or better than them. The next is North Melbourne, and they got a D minus because they finished dead last. We gave Port Adelaide an A minus. Um, we gave them the same grade as Geelong because. They made it to a prelim final um, and lost it. Next is Richmond, and we gave Richmond a D because we had really big expectations for Richmond this year. After winning the flag last year, we thought that they would at least finish in the top eight, maybe even the top four, but they finished outside the eight, which no one was sort of expecting. So they might also be on the side of their rebuild. Um, so For St Kilda, we gave them a C-. minus. Um, they they made the eight last year, but um, didn't really do a lot this year. So I think they could have done better. Uh, next is Sydney, and they gave Sydney a B because they had a really good start to the season. They dropped off towards the end, but they also lost their only final. So that's why we gave them that grade. Um, we have next. We have West Coast. We gave West Coast a, a C. Um, I think that's fair because they didn't make the eight, and I kind of thought that. West Coast are a team that usually make the eight. The team that we're going to rank today is the Western Bulldogs, and we gave them an A because they did, in fact, make the grand final. They also finished outside the top four, and that's quite hard to make a grand final. So they had a really good season um, and probably on to better and better things next year. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.